today is Animal Kingdom. Uh, starting to get used to this scooter. <laughs> it's definitely different coming to the parks this way. Uh, but we've got a few things on tap. Tiffin's for uh, late lunch. Uh, Kilimanjaro Safari, Flight of Passage. And you're gonna have a good time. I love this park. So we're here to hit Animal Kingdom today. Uh, I'm actually the first one at the park, surprisingly enough. Uh, others will be filtering in throughout the day. I think my wife may be taking the day off. She's fighting a pretty good cold and the school year stuff. Uh, but looking forward to having some fun, shooting some footage, uh, checking out what we can. It's gonna be a lot of footage shooting today. <laughs> So they've rebranded this as Donald's Dino Bash, which makes absolutely no sense at all. Okay. But we'll come on in. Everybody's going to the one side, we go to the other. It's a wall. That's right, all that's left of Primeval World is a wall. It's gone! Wow, check out the roof. Okay, the rule at Disney, always look up. I bet most of you have missed this amazing view. It's a train. I like trains. Yay for trains! Okay, look up. <laughs> it's Disney. <laughs> All right, so after some cruising around, shooting some footage and stuff, uh, we are now heading, at least Brenda and I are, single rider, there. Time to go conquer a Yeti. That or do some disco. Disco, disco Yeti. I guess he's supposed to land there. Thank you for joining us for Disney's Hotel. Wow, eyes look eyes at the capacity eyes. crowds. Okay, so we watched uh, King Louie crash at the end of Kite Tales. Uh, checked out the line for Expedition Everest. The single rider line was up, back, up, back, 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 back. And like, nope. Um, dinosaur was an hour wait. <laughs> so, uh, we've now got three of us that are using the Kilimanjaro uh, deal, and so we're going to uh, ride that. Uh, we've got two more that are coming. Uh, they're going to catch it when they get here, and uh, then we'll go from there. I know we've got Lightning Lane's book for Flight of Passage, for Navi, and dinner, or lunch. Lunch, lunch at Tiffany's. Yep. So, uh, we will get both of those in. <laughs> it's funny. The app is warning, you have overlapping things. I'm like, they're right there. No problem. But, uh, but yeah, go do something that I've done a bunch. I actually know one of the mechanics on this ride. Those now hippopotamus do spend most of their day in the water. They go underneath the water for about eight minutes at a time. Their eyes, nose, and ears are all perfectly situated right on the tops of their heads. So they can bob their head in and out of the water in order to catch a breath. They can even do that while they are sleeping. So. As can stand 18 to 20 feet tall, they use their long prehensile tongues to reach all the leaves up on top of those trees. Their tongues can reach up to about 18 inches long. They're sticky like glue and they move a lot like our fingers do. That's how they're able to easily grab onto those leaves. The species of flamingo, even though they are the largest, they get up to about 9 pounds. If you can see some of the gray little puff balls on this far end of the island, a little bit closest to us here. Those are the baby flamingos down there. They're very, very small. These white rhinos can weigh up to about 5,000 pounds. 
Looks like one of the youngest ones running around over here as well. Oh yeah, look at the baby. Coming just behind those trees there. We have two of our youngest white rhinos. One's about five months old, the other one's about six months old. They're about three weeks apart from one another. Okay. <laughs> Let's try this one more time. I thought I was recording. I wasn't. Ha ha. All right. <laughs> so I just got off of Kilimanjaro Safari. Our other two uh, people just got on, so they'll be here in a few minutes. Megan's been on before. Brendan has not, and I'm remembering to film this time. So. Okay, so anything noteworthy, uh, neat, cool, special? Well, other than the different animals, I just really like the waterfall scenes. They were really cool. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, pretty. The giraffes were up and out and super close to us, which was really, really pretty. And I learned a special secret about the ostrich eggs. Yeah, very painful for the ostriches to happen. Never mind. Um, but uh, it was nice because the giraffes were up close. They were starting to feed them. Uh, but if you really want to get close to giraffes, you got to go to bush gardens and do the safari, which they didn't get to do that with us the other day. But um, it, it's cool. Uh, so now we're waiting for our other two. Uh, I believe we're trying to get lightning lanes for dinosaur. Uh, and then we've got them for Flight of Passage. We've got them for Navi River Journey. We've got dinner at Tiffin's. Um, so we got to schedule ahead of us still. All right. Lightning lane for Tough to Be a Bug. we got the whole group here together. And after this is lunch, but sneaking it in and enjoying all the potty humor signs. That was interesting with Tough to Be a Bug, and I'm leaving with the glasses. <laughs> and more oh, blooper reel. Yeah. And I filmed that one. Um, so the spray didn't work. So when they bug sprayed us, we didn't get sprayed. These, get the acid from the termite. The spiders didn't work. So no spiders. So poor Brandon here is a rookie. He missed the buff scary parts. But I, I oh, did get well. prodded one time, and then that was it for me on that. Yeah. But. So yeah, that was kind of a little bit of a bummer on it. But so on the show. Got to make sure I don't lose everybody here. Uh, lunch is calling. Tiffins. We came across this photographer out there that had this really interesting contraption and gizmo. I had to try it out. So what this ball does is it takes a really unique 360 degree shot that looks kind of like this. <laughs> yeah, very cool. After that, it was time for food over at Tiffin's. I love Tiffin's. From the moment you enter in the decor, the architecture, and Brendan and Megan were rookies. So they got to experience something very special here with Tiffin's. I, of course, had to have the beef. Love the beef. We had the bread sampler. And, uh, oh yeah, it was good. And you can see Megan was a little excited about the dessert. Okay, this is a really cool looking dessert, though. <laughs> okay, so meal done at Tiffin's. Good, really good. I'm stuffed. Uh, amazing food. Uh, lots of neat, neat new flavors for people. So, Brendan, did you like Tiffin's? Uh, yes, it was very good. So, uh, so now we're here waiting for our uh, lightning lane for Navi River Journey, and then Flight of Passage. Uh, sounds like a flying cow got out. I don't know what that is. I really enjoy Tiffin's. Yes, yeah, we two rookies at Tiffin's. So good. Uh, but looking forward to just getting. We got Navi River Journey, Flight of Passage, Dinosaur, maybe Everest, maybe. Uh, and then I might actually be meeting another cast member to say hi. So we'll see. Uh, yeah, good stuff. Check out the flying island, the floating island. Ooh. Ah.
first time on Navi River Journey. So what'd you think? Very incredible lighting scenes. It, it, it's just great. I like Navi River Journey. I still kind of mad the bashing got when it first opened. Yeah. It's a nice little ride. Fits the area very well. Very relaxing. Love it's, the animatronic. Miss <laughs> Mahiwa was working just right. fine. So. <laughs> Uh, so now it's Flight of Passage. Yeah, it's beautiful, but it needs a Sherman Brothers song in English. That would work. Yeah. It's a great big future that never existed. I suggested that. Yeah, and yeah, this I... video is officially not safe for Craig. <laughs> uh, just got done with Flight of Passage. I'm going to pull into the shop here. All right, Brendan. Rookie, first timer. What do you think? Awesome ride. I think... Yeah, I'll give him two. Uh -oh. See, I was bad. I forgot my glasses. <laughs> I was going to definitely look for y'all since it came in. All right. Not bad. All right. So, Brendan just got off line passage for the first time. What did you think? It was an awesome ride. The 3D effects were very cool. There were definitely a lot of scenes that made me jump, even though I know it's just, <laughs> even though I know it's not real. And I don't like to get wet on rides, but they missed you just enough, and it makes, it adds just enough to add realism without so, so getting you soaking wet, which is really cool. So, of course, everybody right now is talking Guardians of the Galaxy, best ever. How would you compare it ranking-wise to Guardians? Uh, Guardians isn't anywhere near as good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, that's, okay. it's my favorite simulator ride. Um, it's super immersive, and it smells really good, <laughs> and I really enjoy the drops. I, yeah. I, if you don't like drops, my tip is look up while you're falling toward the ceiling. It doesn't yeah. feel nearly as intense, and also quite by you can fall off that way. True. It, favorite towers still there but yeah this is right up there this rise and tower fight for my favorite spot yeah. um and sorry guardians just ain't there yet so but uh we got a couple more things to catch tonight and i got a meet up i'm doing and uh stuff yeah and nah, 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 nah. they're laughing at me dri recording while driving so all right so we are on the way out of pandora Trying to make sure I don't run into people. Yeah. Don't yeah, record. In the box. <laughs> yeah, the box would be a bad thing to open. Uh, we've got dinosaur. Uh, did we? We didn't manage to book expedition Everest, did we? I can try again in about 15 minutes. Okay, so we will see if we get Everest. I don't know. Um, I do know that there's some pins in one of the shops here I want to get that I haven't seen at the others. So a little bit of pin shopping, and then to the hotel. Uh, and get rested because tomorrow will be a fairly long day because I got to be at the park early and then I got to get prepared for my flight the next day early. Oh, yeah, I got to check in even earlier for my flight. <laughs> Woo! But there's rise of the resistance Wee. to be ridden. Oh, yes. Aha. Yep. So we lost them briefly. I love Kevin. To a bird. <laughs> the Megan won't let me show you. Bird is the word. <laughs> yeah, bird. Bird brains for Sorry. Kevin. It's almost like three, two, one penguins. Kevin. So we'll get Megan taking her selfie. This is actually a couple of my kids' favorite ride here. They they love this ride. Uh, this is the one Amber would ride over Flight of Passage. So, so I like I like taking a ride on it. It's fun. We're booking Lightning Lanes. Craig's booking Lightning Lanes because he's the man. And we've noticed one thing consistent over the last three days. Uh, one, it doesn't list your times in order. It, they, oh. they really seem random. And then what happened again, I was seeing 9.55 as the available time at Big Thunder Mountain, so I was planning to park hop. I go and book it, and then it gives me 8.45 as the start of my window. Not the worst, it, it, but weird. <laughs> just, yeah, an okay time, but what if you had something else booked or... It, it's weird the way the times bounce around. We've been very good about being able to book rides and attractions, but the weird time inconsistencies are, I don't know, for us a minor inconvenience, but I can see them being a major annoyance for some. <laughs> I just want to see how much you were going to spill. Only a little bit. <laughs> I do like this queue though, because it looks like a dino museum. Especially that part. Ooh. Dinosaur.
kept telling us we're not going to make it. We made it. We made it. <laughs> uh, have fun, Dino. Again, his first time on it. So, what do you think? A little rough at some points. Some, little of rough. some scenes even kind of took me by a little bit by surprise. <laughs> it was kind of fun yelling, beat me up, Scotty, at one point. <laughs> So it'll be fun seeing what the picture looks like and how everybody's expressions, yeah. uh, especially those who had no idea it was coming. But right. I love this ride. It's just now I do like Indy better, uh, which I know Craig got my reference there at the beginning. I have a feeling you probably didn't get it, but someday we'll get them on Indy and then they can understand why I was yelling out, "Don't look into the eye." Yeah, I don't understand. <laughs> I was thinking I have Sauron or something. Yeah, no, <laughs> had a lot of fun on Everest. Uh, Brendan's first time, uh, he didn't get a great picture, uh, but uh, I love that coaster ever since I got a chance to open it. Great ride. Uh, heading back, got to pick up a few pins, and then uh, it's back to the hotel, meeting up with a couple cast members there, I and my wife for dinner, and then going to crash for the evening. But it's been a great day here.